<laughs> okay, everybody, and it's time for the amazing finale in the Back to the Future Nintendo Trilogy with Back to the Future 3. Seeing as how I didn't get through part 2, I have to use a cheat code to get to part 3. But that's not, I'm a cheater, it's just, it, what the frick is this? Okay, of course, I know the cheat, so obviously I wouldn't know this. Um, did, it, did it do it? F. Nope, okay, F. Oh, okay, I see. Well... This is going to take a bit of time. But I can understand. I mean, part three has got to be amazing. It's It's got to be like a completely different game from part two. So, of course, they have to hide it behind this secret lucrative password. And I need to make sure I'm doing it right. Flux capacitator is the power. Well, flux. Ka. 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 I'm like a spelling genius. And shut up, Jets. I don't I don't know if they can hear you in the microphone, but no one wants to hear you. Why do I have to live near an Air Force base? Why? I'm like paranoid parent here. I know how to spell it. I've just got to make sure I'm spelling it right. Flux capacitor. Flux capacitor is le power. Yes, I did it. I guess I hit start. This seems really familiar. But, you came to the rescue, defeated, and recovered the almanac. Of course I did. Because I'm like a freaking superhero genius, man. You destroyed it. Yeah, it was beautiful. The explosions were so beautiful. All was well. Until. Marty, help. I was lost it in time and ended up in the wild west of 1875 if you don't come and get me soon the time ripple effect will start to change the future hurry doc well i wonder like i don't know just forget it looks like it is not over yet marty now you have a new quest to find le doc quick off you go marty Well, what is going on here? Did it seriously just kill me? Oh, uh, what the? What the? Oh, this is gonna be fun. This is gonna be real fun. Jesus, I just started. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. There's an it word. Oh, oh, no. Okay, I can jump down there. I don't know the point of that crooked arrow. Oh no, this looks like a really hard version of part two because I figured out what to do in part two, obviously. Um. <laughs> no! At least the car had the decency to put me in safety. Oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Ah! Screw you, walking sombrero. Okay, so. I can't spin. Oh, gee, oh now the, uh, this is just embarrassing. Don't drop me all the way back here. Yeah. 
don't understand that bear. God, sweet. If I make it to the end of here and I don't see a, an explanation on what to do, which I doubt it, why would they stick an explanation in part three, if not one in part two? Oh, leave me alone! Jesus Christ, that scorpion's hopping on the cloud! Go in here, go in here! I can't go in there! Oh, I should have known. Leave me alone. Oh, oh, I didn't even see that scorpion. Yes. Well, this is gonna be it's gonna be fun, like I said. We're gonna give it a chance. We're gonna walk uh, we're gonna get to the end of the map. Oh no. Oh no. Oh you bird bastard. Okay, we're making it there. Not exactly how we're supposed to. We're getting there. And there's nothing here. What do I do? What do I do? It's, it's time to Google this. It's time to Google. How in the fuck do you play this game? Funk the dealer drinking game rules and... Wow, well, okay, I'm about to actually type this in right. How in... How do you play... Back to the Future 2 and 3? care about the movie what do you have to do what do you have to do gameplay okay <sighs> the player controls Mario in this video by jumping on or throwing projectiles at them player must also collect fuel for the time machine and junk food for extra lives as they progress through each timeline scattered and hidden through each timeline are object rooms containing objects and la da 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 Um, there's no explanation here. No explanation here. I must seem like a weirdo to my family right now because at least they're not in the living room. But unlike the other two, I'm not recording this in the middle of the night. Ah, Wikipedia, you disappoint me. YouTube can show the answers. YouTube knows all. YouTube doesn't tell me anything. I'm going to... Uh, so, uh, the only thing I managed to gather is that... That clown just spit out a squirrel? I need to collect these junk foods to get extra lives. Since I couldn't go anywhere here, I guess I need to kill some enemies. Hope oh, some object. Oh, a key. I got a key. I got a key. Yeah, what now? Can't own the second one I ran. You're supposed to find like a remote control or something. But this isn't the second one. And this one hasn't made any reference to a remote control. Of any sort and this skunk this has got to be like the hardest enemy in the game okay uh, here we go oh, yeah I like it I like the way that goes off that's actually how neat I would kill it oh, squirrel. come on scroll <laughs> fuck okay <laughs> okay yes I killed it Oh, that's wonderful. I didn't even get anything. I spent like all my life trying to kill that. Oh no. Oh. 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 No. Fuck. No, don't take me back there, you. <sighs> okay. <sighs> that's great. Do I, do I get. Do I still have my key? Do I still have my key? No, I don't have my key. I don't have my key. I'll kill you, you sombrero. Oh, the key. <sighs> At least the keys seem to appear more often now. Unless it's that one enemy who has it. If so, I just I lost it. 
bring it on. Wow. He just committed suicide. Like, it was nothing. Oh, you know what? Nothing to do here. Oh, no! Okay, we made it, we made it. I can't make it over this ravine. Once I make it here, no, I was so on that. Once I make it across here, I am never going back. Never. I hit the jump button. Oh wow, you can tell the bird to drop you whenever. Oh, I didn't know that. That's something nice now. Oh, I made it. Things are looking up. Oh my yeah, drop it no Oh yeah yeah. Yeah yeah. Oh no, oh no. Yeah yeah. What the Well I think he just committed suicide too. Don't worry, his clones will have to come back. Get this one. Boom! Get that pizza. Bring it on, yo. I got this. There's a snake in my boot. Oh, great. I'm dead. That's wonderful. Oh, no. That star looked important. Okay, so can I... I can't go in here. And this is the only place in the entire level to go. Even though there's multiple signs pointing towards the ground. Pizza. Oh, that bastard. Yeah, killed you. Now I see why they released 2 and 3 at the same time. They're practically the same game. What is that? Do I get that? Oh, it looks suspicious. Okay, that's it. Whatever happens, I'm not stopping recording. Even if my family wants to continue to screw with me. I knew today was a bad day. The, the freaking jets will shut up and my mother and my sister are leaving the kitchen for reasons unknown. Now, where were we? Let's, let's see. Is this dangerous? No. Actually, what it gave me some. Oh! I wonder if this rock does something. Ooh, a hole. Oh, you piss fucking skull. Oh, great. Not this again. At least it's shorter than the other game and still doesn't help. I don't know what it is. I think anybody knows what it is. That's why I couldn't find instructions on how to play this. Oh my god! There's, there's people everywhere! What did Marty do to make the Indians and the bears and the cowboys and everybody just so mad at him? Oh, Marty, I, I don't think I've collected a star yet. I need to get one of those. Well, that scorpion just committed suicide. All this suicide from skunks to scorpions to whatever that was. I didn't even think I jumped there. Okay, so I've reached the end of the screen, and I don't have anything. I guess I need to go back and kill some more sombrero. What? Okay. You know, somehow. I that was just wonderful. That was just wonderful. 
Somehow I have a feeling that the walking sombreros are related to the walking spike shells in the first game. Hey, no, no. No, you shut up. I'm trying to record this. Now, people on the internet are gonna understand how hateful you are when you come in here and you interrupt this. That stupid scorpion. I'm gonna get an attitude with you if you don't shut up. Run, 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 run. No! Well, I don't know what to do. I just keep... I'm not talking to myself! I don't know what to do. I just keep... Just jumping on things and sometimes we're dying, sometimes not. It seems to be... I'm not talking to myself! Ooh, I know what the keys are for. Okay, so the key allows me to go in here. So that's actually discovered something. Alright, here we go again. And yes, as you can see, we've jumped to this. Because I accidentally let the timer run down while I was distracted. After I got the key. Now this should be a ex true explanation of why this is called Let's Try Playing. And I had to stop because even though I said that I wasn't going to stop, but out oh, there I go dying again. My sister was being a little bitch and my mom was at the kitchen and then there was like a fight and then everybody died in the end. I guess I gotta find the key again. At least I have like. Uh, at least I know what to do now. It's, it's just a bad day to record this, but I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I have 80 points and I don't care. I swear, my 80 points and I don't care. And I just died the same way that I died before. I don't care because the skunk is popping out of the clouds or his pants. I don't really know. Either way, it doesn't make sense Like nothing in this game Or the game for it Or can I go in here? Do I need to find the key? Yep, I need that key There's a snake in Marty's boot Somebody's poisoned the water hole This town ain't big enough for the two of us Oh yeah, I can probably... I know I'm supposed to be killing these people. I'm not exactly getting any keys here. And I need a key. I need a key, I need the key. The key was supposed to be in the mausoleum. But it's not. I just killed Windwolf. And I'm out alive once again. I'm on the road again, on my own, I don't know if it's a real song, but I don't care, cause no one knows about anything that's going on in this town, and fuck that skunk, and whatever that was, get that sombrero. Whatever that was, you know, I didn't see anything. <sighs> At this point in the recording, I'm estimating uh, 17, no, uh, 19 minutes in. I would like to take notice. I would like you to take notice here. 
and look up at the sky in this game. It is filled with something, something important. If you if you can see it, it's it's sort of a purplish color. It's all the fucks I give. As you can see, there are none. So let's go and kill some more sombreros, or just die from sombreros. At least this guy doesn't have seizures like in the first game. He just dies. He just dies. He skips the seizure procedure. Seizure and procedure. And this arrow doesn't... It went somewhere. Well. It actually goes somewhere. Did not know that. I guess it's like a teleporter. Well. I wonder if there's anything like that in the first game. Kind of shocking. Oh, some more places to explore. Maybe I can find a key here. Or just get shot by that jerk. You know, I think these are pretty much mostly the enemies from the first game. It's probably all the enemies from the first game with like pallets and stuff switch. Dang, he's a pro at shooting that arrow. Did you see the way it like it like had a homing No, there was a key! Had a homing signal in it. But yeah, I have a feeling they did, and some of them probably came from the later levels, which I never got to. No, oh, I so made that. Okay. Uh, I'm pretty sure I wasn't here. But once again. You can look up in that sky- Oh wait, there's some purple stuff now. Well, I guess I better start giving a fuck. I guess I need to start. Yes, I got distracted. I thought that thing was going to carry me. Because that's kind of the thing that drops you off, isn't it? Oh, another door. But I don't have a key. Oh, I did not see him. I gotta give him that. This game's got realism. Snakes, they can be hard to see sometimes. This is probably the most realistic game I've ever played. I mean, look at that. Look at him. He's just walking on thin air. You know skunks, badgers, whatever the freak that is. Maybe a squirrel. You know they do that. You may not think you know they do that, but you know they do that. Because that time, you see him like... It's, it's just out of the corner of your eye. It's really quick. You gotta, like, pay attention because these guys are sneaky. They walk on thin air. Jesus thinks he's special by walking on water. These guys are the true heroes. They can walk on thin air. I don't know really what else to say. This is pretty much the same as Back to the Future 2. So I'm going to conclude with that thought. That, that lesson that, that you can bring with you into your life you may think Jesus is special and this may seem to offend you but he's not as special as squirrels or ba and badgers because they can walk on thin air and all Jesus can do is walk on water I'm going to leave you with that I, I bid you la farewell or not I bid you la farewell did I just kill it? Okay, I bid you. Okay, I don't, just, just let me do this a few more times, and then you will get the true farewell. Yeah. Oh, I think that's a tumbleweed. That is a tumbleweed. Okay. Okay. Wow, apparently you can kill stuff by running real fast into it, even though I should be quitting now. Like I said I was. Okay, this is it. This is it. We had to make the ending dramatic. And that is it. The end.